Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and this is Urvashi and in today's video I'm going to talk about how you can use ChatGPT for your UX work. I will give you some examples that you can use in your daily design work. So without further delay, let's get started. UX designers can leverage ChatGPT in various ways to enhance their work and create more user-friendly and engaging digital products. So here are some ways that UX designer can, can use uh, ChatGPT in their daily design work. So first of all, I will give you an example in which they can create user personas uh, for different target audiences. So first of all, they have to create a simple prompt uh, and then we will type that simple prompt here. So if you want to create the user persona for any working professional, the, the, the prompt will be generate user persona for a working professional so that's how you will type different prompts on chat gpt it's the simple one in which uh, we are creating the user persona for a working professional so let's just uh, create this one so that's how it will create the user persona for you based on the target audience that you have written so it it specified all of the things here from name age gender occupation location background work life work environment goals and motivations challenges interest and hobbies then tax saviness values and preferred brands so that's how chat gpt creates a imaginary user persona when you type in the uh, initials like what you want what user persona you want chat gpt to create you have to type in there so i am uh, giving you some simple prompts that you can use while creating these user personas for next, uh, I will give you an example in which UX designers can create product description for different products. So for that, you have to type a very simple prompt that says generate product description for a smartphone, for a beauty product, for a makeup product. So you have to specify the product for which you have you want to create the product description. So I will take the example for the smartphone here. Generate product description for a smart phone. You can also create button text. Um, body text and all those uh, you can uh, create all the content on your app or a website by using chat GPT so here you can see uh, chat GPT is creating the product description for a 5g smartphone so here you can see there is a, a small description then here are the key features blazing 5g connectivity stunning display powerhouse performance all day battery life versatile camera system enhanced security ample storage immersive audio sleek design latest os smart assistance and water and dust resistance so that's how you can create a product description for different different products you just have to specify the product uh, for which you want to create the product description you can create other content as well and you can use this prompt only for that particular content example that i will take is for user testing uh, for uh, UX designers, user testing is very important and uh, 
for user testing we have to create different different scenarios and scripts so that we can use it uh, while testing the product and for that you can uh, generate your user testing scripts on chat gpt so it's very easy you have to specify your product and uh, while uh, typing the prompt so i will give you an example how you can do that it's a very simple prompt generate user testing scripts for a e-commerce platform so you can specify your product at the end so that you can uh, get uh, relevant answers on that so here you can see uh, it's, uh, it, it has created the script first of all there is an introduction uh, you can give the introduction first of all while doing the user testing then there are participant information then here comes the registration and account setup like how you will do it so first scenario is imagine you are a new customer your first task is to create an account on the platform so it's the first scenario this scenario will be given to the user and here are the ins instructions like navigate to the registration page fill out the necessary information to create an account take note of any challenges or confusing steps then you will ask the questions like was the registration process straightforward did you encounter any difficulties during account setup were the instruction clear and easy to follow so that's how you will give them the scenario then here comes the browsing and product search one more scenario you are looking to buy a specific product example a smartphone pair of shoes a book find this product on our platform then this is a scenario then you will give the instructions like use the search bar or browse through categories to find the product take note of your experience including the search results and product detail page then you will ask the questions like were you able to find the product easily did the search results seem relevant how user friendly was the product details page did you encounter any issues with navigation or filters so that's how you will ask them the question at the end so that's how you can create a simple user testing script that will help you while doing the user testing uh, it has the scenario it has instruction it has questions and you can also add yours as well so that's how you can use chat gpt for creating user testing scripts now i will give you an example in which you can create error messages for your app or a website so error messages are very important while you want to communicate something there are like uh, you want to communicate that there is something wrong with your website right now you can't move forward so for that you can create very catchy um, error messages by using chat gpt so for that you can type in a very simple prompt here generate error messages for a payment app you have to specify for what app or a website you want to create the error message so uh, you can see there are uh, different examples for that like ins insufficient funds invalid card number expired card card decline network error, error so for all of these scenarios chat gpt has created different messages so you can add for the heading transaction failed insufficient funds and in description you can add this message appears when the user's account balance is not sufficient to complete the requested transaction so it's the it's basically a description like when this message will appear then invalid card num card number then card expired payment declined network connection error server unavailable then transaction timed out so that's how you can create uh, error messages for different apps and website example in which ux designers can use chat gpt to create epic use for different different products so for that you can type in a very simple prompt here generate epic use 
and remember to specify your product at the very end of the prompt i have created these prompt by myself you can create yours as well so generate faq use for a fintech company as you can see uh, chat gpt is creating very basic uh, questions here you can add your uh, company's name name here as well what is fintech company's name then how can i sign up for an account with this and in my is my personal and financial information safe with this what financial services does uh, this offer so that's how you can create different different faqs for your products just you just have to specify your company and uh, your company or maybe what your company does so that's how you can create faqs for your for your uh, website or app the example in which ux designers can use chat gpt for creating empathy maps for different users so for this i will give you a very simple example generate empathy map of a student so that's how you can create empathy map using chat gpt it's not a uh, real it's imaginary i know but you will get some insights you will get some insights like how uh, you can approach a particular problem or how you can create your persona so uh, using chat gpt uh, it becomes easy to create empathy maps and user personas uh, they are not real but you will get some insights into it uh chat gpt has created the persona uh, there are some question like what does the student see uh, classroom settings with desk whiteboards educational materials fellow students engrossed in learning a variety of extracurriculum activities in clubs then what does the student hear teachers explaining concepts and giving instructions classmates discussing assignments and projects the bell signaling the end of the classes conversation about upcoming exams and assignments what does the student say and do actively participate in class discussion and group projects ask questions when in doubt what does the student think and feel excitement and curiosity about learning new things then what are the student pain and gains fear of failure and not meeting academic uh, expectations balancing part time work and student study peer pressure and social challenges financial constraints and student loans a sense of accomplishment when achieving good grades building knowledge and skills for future career opportunities so that's how uh, chat gpt creates uh, empathy map based on the user that you have selected or typed in in which ux designers can use chat gpt to create information architecture for their app or a website it will be a very helpful uh, when you are designing a product and want to understand how you will uh, design your uh, product step by step so for that you can type in a very easy very simple prompt to create a information architecture for any products you just have to specify your product at the end like i said earlier generate information architecture of a beauty app it creates a uh, information architecture very well i have created it earlier so that's how i know uh, like you can see uh, it has created for different different pages like home page featured products promotion and deal search bar navigation menu then categories skin care makeup hair care fra uh, fragrances then product listings then product details then user profile shopping cart so it has created it uh, with its own knowledge you can refine it uh, further uh, by using your data and whatever you are uh, using at that time so for that you can refine it further it has created it 
with ai so you can use your knowledge by refining this particular information architecture and make it more effective more useful for our users and for yourself so that's how you can create information architecture for different different products you just have to specify your product at the very end like i have specified here for of a beauty app so that's how you can create information architecture for your products it will really help you uh, like for creating your product step by step and example in which ux designers can use chat gpt to do their task so next one is you can generate user surveys or chat based user surveys um by using chat gpt so for that it's very easy actually you just have to type in generate chat based user surveys so that's how you can create different different uh, user surveys by using chat gpt uh, user surveys are very important when we do ux research so it will really help ux designers by creating different questions on chat gpt you can refine it further but you can get different ideas from chat gpt you can define your product at the end i didn't define it here but you can define it for, like for which product you want to create the user surveys so it will create the questions based on that so here you can see how it has uh, created different questions please please tell your name or a nickname you would like us to use which features of our product and service do you use the most so it's the uh, chat based user survey like feedback survey you can say it or you can create a simple user survey that you can use in your research so for that you can type in generate user survey for a e-commerce platform so that's how you can create your user surveys while doing the user research so here you can see it has included all the things name age gender then how often do you shop on e-commerce platform what type of products do you typically purchase on our platform so that's how chat gpt creates a whole user survey for you to do user research you can refine it further you can add your question you can uh, make your question even better by using chat gpt guys enjoyed this video and if you did then do not forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that like button and do not forget to follow me on instagram link is in the description and i will see you all in my next video bye bye